All right, everyone, buckle up because you sent in a ton of articles about Tesla's new Robovan. And yeah, I'm pretty pumped to dig into this. A totally new vehicle, classic Elon Musk, really. Totally. And the design, one of these articles called it 1950s Art Deco on Wheels. It's like they pulled it straight out of a retro futuristic dream. It's certainly eye catching, but it's more than just a pretty face. This thing is huge. They're saying it can fit up to 20 passengers. 20 passengers. Can you imagine that many people piling into this thing? I mean, that's getting close to the capacity of some city buses. Think about the implications for public transportation, especially in urban areas looking for greener, more efficient solutions. It's mind blowing. Yeah. And don't forget, no driver, no steering wheel, no pedals. It's yeah. all autonomous. Right. Completely autonomous. This isn't just Tesla dipping their toes into a new market. This screams paradigm shift. They're building a platform, something with the potential to turn entire industries upside down. Okay, before we get too far ahead of ourselves, one thing that caught my eye is how this robovan almost seems to hover. All those pictures, it's like it's barely touching the ground. Yeah, that super low ground clearance, it's not just a design quirk. It's all thanks to this really cool suspension system, automatic load leveling, they call it. It basically adjusts the height of the vehicle depending on the road conditions. So potholes, a thing of the past, sign me up. Right, but it goes even further. One source even suggests that this suspension tech could end up in all Teslas with full self-driving. Now that would be a game changer. Imagine a Tesla that could adjust its suspension on the fly to smooth out any bumps in the road. Not just a smoother ride, but potentially a much safer one, too. Safer and more stylish. What's not to love? Speaking of style, let's dive into some of those other cool design features. We've talked about how big this Robovan is, that head-turning design, and how it's completely autonomous. But here's where things get really fascinating. It's not just about moving people. This thing can haul cargo, too. That's right. The source highlights Tesla's vision for the Robovan as a potential solution to a major headache in the delivery world, that last mile delivery. And speaking of headaches, this source even suggests the Robovan could be used as a mobile service center. Yeah, imagine that instead of taking your Tesla in for service, the service comes to you. Wow, that would be pretty amazing. It really speaks to Tesla's goal of creating a versatile platform. The Robovan isn't limited to just one purpose. It's designed to be adaptable with the potential to revolutionize everything from public transportation to logistics to even, and get this, the RV industry. Okay, now you're talking my language, a self-driving RV. That's something I need to see. Right. It's a pretty incredible vision of the future, but of course there's still a lot of unknowns here. Yeah. For one thing, there's no price tag yet and no firm release date. I wonder how much something like this is even going to cost. Right. So that's the million dollar question, literally. But hey, at least we know how to pronounce it. We do. Yeah, apparently it's Rubo Vaughn, like suburban, but way cooler. It does have a nice ring to it, but mm. pronunciation aside, I think the real question is what does the Robo Vaughn tell us about Elon Musk's vision for the future of transportation? Is this just a publicity stunt? Or is this the start of something truly revolutionary? It's as if he threw this big, shiny, Robovan shaped curveball at us, and now we're all scratching our heads trying to figure out what it all means. And that's the beauty of a deep dive like this. We get to take all this information, all these different perspectives, and try to connect the dots. You know, as we're going through these articles, there's one detail that's really sticking with me. Oh, what's that? The windows, of all things. The windows. Yeah. They're tinted delk on the outside, which already looks cool, right? Mm. But here's the kicker. They're designed to be see-through from the inside. Oh, wow, that's neat. So you get privacy and a view. Best of both worlds. Exactly. And speaking of the view, did you catch those pictures of the interior? It looks super spacious. Yeah, it does. And remember how we were talking about those big screens at either end of the cabin? Imagine the possibilities with those. Oh, I know. Road information, entertainment, maybe even some interactive maps. Definitely. It's like a mobile living room, especially with that kind of tech. Right. It's really hard to wrap your head around, you know. This whole thing is like next level. It really is. And it makes you wonder, is this a glimpse into the future of transportation or what? It really does. Well, folks, looks like we've reached the end of the road for today's deep dive, at least on the subject of the Tesla Robovan. It certainly was a fascinating ride, though. It really was. And who knows what surprises await us down the line. Exactly. The future is full of them. It sure is. <laughs> but until then... Keep those engines revved, and we'll catch you in the next deep dive.